Wait, why am I making this video? Oh, that's right. The reason I'm making this video is because I got some inspiration from this guy by the name of D-Mad Hacks. You might have heard of him, but in case you haven't, I'll fill you in. D-Mad Hacks is a very small YouTuber who makes videos about tech. His videos are amazing, so go check him out. I'll put the links down in the description. I also want to make this video to help people who are getting into game development and need something to build their game with. So I will be comparing my two favorite game engines to help you decide which one is right for you. So let's get right into the video! We will look over five parts in this review. The introduction, the interface, the graphics, and aesthetics. The programming and my favorite feature. Blender is a modeling and animation 3D program that is available on both Mac and PC. Blender can also be used to make games using Blender's game engine, which of course is what we're interested in. You may remember a 3D animation that I uploaded on this channel a while back. That was made with Blender. I would have to say that the interface is very bland and not colorful. It's just gray and black and nothing more. Not a big fan of the interface. The graphics are really good, but by default the aesthetics aren't very good. However, I've seen people make some outstanding looking animations and games with great aesthetics with Blender. So I would have to say, overall, looks really good. Programming is what you need to tell your game what to do. Blender gives you two options for programming. You can either program using Blender's built-in game logic editor, or you can use the programming language Python. Both are really good and pretty easy to learn. However, the game logic editor is probably best for beginners. My favorite feature that Blender has is the soft body physics type. What this does is it makes an object become plush. This is so fun to play around with. Unreal Engine 4 is a powerful game engine which powers many popular games such as Fortnite, Bioshock, Batman Arkham City, and many more. The interface looks really good. It's not really the gray and black that makes it look good. It's the icons. They look really good. The graphics sort of vary, but the aesthetics are really good. The default skybox looks good, and the default lighting looks good as well. Like Blender, Unreal Engine 4 has two options for programming the Blueprint system, and the C++ programming language. Blueprint is just like game logic. C++ is just like Python. I love the Blueprint system. The game presets are so good. They help you make a game much quicker. My favorites include first person, third person, and vehicle. So which is better in my opinion. Well, my favorite is Unreal Engine 4. Here's why. Unreal Engine has good aesthetics by default. Blender doesn't. However, I like the graphics better in Blender, but that doesn't really win against the better aesthetics that Unreal has. But that's just me. What really matters is what you think. Tell me in the comments below. I hope this video helped in some way or uh, was entertaining at least. Please consider subscribing for more videos. See you later. Meme Star out.